Hello, everyone. I'm Jin Yang Hu from Hula University. It is my honor to report our work on Ubicon 20 and 21. The title of my report is Drive Sonar, Fan Grant Dangerous Driving Detection Using Active Sonar. In fact, this work provides a new method for dangerous driving actions detection. It was done by Hong Bo Jiang, Dai Bo Liu, Jie Xiong, Min Jie Cai, and me. I would like to thank them and all volunteers for their effort in this work. In the last decade, a lot of important measures had been developed to enhance driving safety, yet a significant number of safe accidents still occurred all over the world. Traffic accidents causes economy loss, joinings and destruction are the major causes of traffic accidents. It is therefore critical and urgent to develop a system which can accurately detect the dangerous driving behaviors and alert drivers in real time, preventing potential car accidents. To detect dangerous driving actions, existing solutions have explored different methods by monitoring various driving features. However, inherent limitations existed in these solutions. Specifically, the biology features are usually intrusive to be measured. Physical features are suspected to individual diversity and background noise, and vehicular features are vulnerable to weather and traffic conditions. Moreover, although traditional vision-based systems can achieve a high detection accuracy, cameras do raise serious privacy concerns, heightening the wise adoption of these systems. Inspired by the above observations, we present the drive sonar. The key insight of drive sonar is that these dangerous driving motions cause unique signal variations and we can thus exploit these distinctive signal features. The proposed system detects dangerous driving actions and generates real-time alarms using off-the-shelf smartphones. The reason for using a smartphone to detect the dangerous driving actions first Different driving actions need to constant changes in the distance between the smartphone and the driver head and hand. Second, the smartphone periodically transmits the chip signal and tracks the anchors from both head and steering hand with the built-in microphone. After feasibility study, we found signal features including the variation of the signal amplitude. The duration of the abnormal state is different between different actions. The whole system consists of four models, acoustic signal generation and pre-processing, head and hand anchor detector, fine grind feature extraction, and dangerous driving action detection. We set the duration of chip as one minute. The interval between adjacent chip is set to less than five milliseconds, so all anchors with the range of the one meter can be captured. When a chip signal is transmitted from the speaker, part of the signal directly propagates to the microphone through the line of sight paths, and others are reflected by different obstructions. To identify the anchors reflected by head and snake hand from the received signals, drive sonar explores the correlation between the received signal and the original transmitted chip signal by computing the relative correlation coefficient. By applying RCC and the property of motion continuity, we can effectively spread the multiple anchors and obtain the motion change of corresponding objects in time domain. To show the distance change of objects, drive sonar transforms the RCC distance profile in time series into the change of distance between the objects and the smartphone. In the last, According to these characteristics of hand and head, drive sonar can effectively emulate potential interference anchors in advance. Then the profile is transformed into a condensed version. After head and hand anchor detection, the behavior features in driving are exploited to identify anchors reflected from driver's head and hand. It is rational to use the fine grant features of driving actions involving both head and skin hand in time domain to detect potential dangerous driving actions. In the driving action detection path, we use DTW-based motion change series matching algorithm to detect the dangerous driving action. Then, driver sonar adopts two different side degrees to deal with destructive driving and drawless driving respectively. We collected data from 30 volunteers in both real cars and driving simulators. We instructed the volunteers to mimic drawing driving, such as loading, yawing, hand off the steering wheel and looking outside for a while. 
The specific details are not repeated here. In the experiment, we evaluate the overall system performance of Drivesona. These results indicate that Drivesona can reliably detect the dangerous driving actions in real time and timely alert drivers when they are in dangerous driving states. We also have a lot of experiments on the impact of volunteers and driving conditions on the performance of Drivesona. These results indicate that Drivesona can adapt to different users and driving conditions. In general, we propose and design Drivesona, a dangerous driving detection system using smartphones. We exploited the motion parts of both head and string hand joint to determine the dangerous driving action. We implement the prototype of Drivesona and conduct extensive experiments in both simulator and real driving environments. The result shows that Drivesona can effectively detect dangerous driving actions in real time. Thank you for your attention. Please contact me if you have any questions.